This past week's pickups, episode number 18. So these are pickups from a small show here in Iowa. I actually set up at this show. So essentially what I did is I sold around $600. Now it wasn't a big show. There wasn't a lot of people. There was a 40 table show. Not a huge turnout. But what I sold were a bunch of $2 cards that I showed in my previous videos. Mostly that's what I sold. I sold a card for 100 I sold some $5 cards and I sold $2 cards. So that's basically what I try to do at shows. And then I take that money that I get and I try to find stuff at the shows that I'm at to buy. So this is what I got. I I think I got $500 into these. So with the 600, I was able to pay for these cards and my show table, the fees and we got some nice stuff here so let's get straight into it so the first dealer i got a couple of cards just a ryan sandberg rookie these were five dollars a piece and a cal ripken jr rookie nice deal there for five dollars we got a dave collins rookie for 15 that's a good deal on that and then i just i don't know what these are worth these are 90s marvel cards they're like holograms and inserts and stuff like that so i'll have to comp these out and see what they're worth so either i will sell them on ebay as a complete set or they'll go to com c sell them individually so you know i don't know what these are worth but i'm assuming i can at least get my money back i'm taking a chance i got 50 bucks for the three sets I think I'll make my money back easily and then some. So the rest of these cards that I have all came from the same dealer. He had everything was half off. He was kind of clearing out stuff. And honestly, most of the prices were already okay. And then on top of that, half off. So let's see what we got here. So a couple 74 Nolan Ryan. So remember, marked at 8 they were four dollars and actually since i'm i'm trying to bundle a whole bunch of stuff together i got better than half off on all this stuff so an eight dollars for that card already is a pretty good price they're not terrible shape but a couple of those ted williams 69 you know we got some big names in here bob gibson boggs rookie you know a johnny bench 71 76 couple of bonds rookies for a buck a piece you know and then some vintage cards 50 cents some you know Johan Santana for 50 cents uh, memorabilia card there's a pocket memorabilia bat half off of all these another pocket rookie this was a sweet card I thought it's got Rod Carew and Pete Rose on it. So we got a Rod Carew bat and a Pete Rose jersey. Ten bucks for that. Pretty sweet card. A Molitor for ten bucks. Autograph numbered out of a hundred. Then we got like Del Delgado rookie auto. Ryan Braun picked up some Trouts. Some Kobe's. You know, cheap Kobe's for a buck a piece, 50 cents, four bucks. More memorabilia cards, Bobby Shantz. So here is a Harmon Killebrew. It's beat up, but that was less than 100 bucks. Tough to find those. Here's a nice Andy Pettit autograph. Willie Mays, 72. You know, and then I was just trying to get some Jordans, 50 cents a piece for the Jordans. Buy those all day long. I got some LeBrons. Memorabilia, there's a Kobe. Whitey Ford, 67 for 250. Some Bo Jackson rookies, 86 tops traded. More autographs, Bucky Dent vintage cards memorabilia cards refractors bagwell verlander 
Another Verlander. Drexler, second year. Starting lineup, Joe Montana. Larry Bird. Vintage basketball. There's autographs. Carl Malone, second year. Some trout refractor there. This was a pretty cool card here. It's a Beckett pre-production one of one. Not, I have no idea what that's worth, but a dollar fifty. I'm gonna buy that. You got a Robin Roberts. This is a Bowman 53 Bowman reprint. Certified slab autograph. Here's a nice Mike Trout. 25 bucks for that. Numbered out of 25. We got a Gem Mint 10 SGC. 2018 Panini. A nice looking card there. There's a Garnett and a few other players there. Floor. Louis Dampier, who just passed away, Hall of Famer. Shaq rookie, more Jordan. So a Jerry West for 20 bucks. I gotta believe this is at least a hundred dollar card. I'll have to look at up look up all these, but a Jerry West auto for 20 bucks. Great deal there. We got a Kobe. In the paint numbered out of 199. That's a jersey. Another jersey, Kobe. <clears throat> Jason Richardson and Kobe Bryant numbered out of the thousand there. Nice card there. Anything Kobe like that, that's decent price. Gonna try to buy those. A nice nice Jim Plunkett jersey. Some more vintage here. A few autographs. We had some vintage football there for 50 cents a piece. Another Louis Dampier. And then a Kenny Anderson. Exquisite. Carl Malone jersey. Jackie Robinson. Just some of these vintage cards for super cheap. A nice Willie McCovey. That is a higher number. 517. Another bow rookie. This was a cool card here. This is a Big Bats Kirby Puckett. Numbered 1 of 5. It is number 1. I have no idea what these go for, but I just felt like Kirby Puckett. Numbered out of 5. Probably worth that. It's a trout that's numbered out of 499. You know, here's a 59 Fleer. Ted Williams for 50 cents. Vintage Mays. Mac Jones rookie. Some Brady's here. Other Mac Jones rookies. More Brady. I try to pick out the biggest stars, Jordan, Brady, and Kobe. You can't go wrong with buying that kind of stuff. Dave Concepcion, rookie for a buck. You know, a lot of the stuff I I don't know what it what it books out at, but I know it's got to be worth what I more than what I paid for. There's a this is an older Tom Brady. I think it's 2000, 2002 Pacific. Some star basketball from '84. Another Trout Gold Cup. This is a pretty cool card here. Home Run, Bats, Gonzalez, Albert Bell, Joe Carter. Some Conseco Minor Leagues. More Trouts here. Just some cheaper Trouts. David Eckstein Auto. Jordan. 76, Pete Rose. Here's a Mike Schmidt Mini for a dollar. Mark Fidrich rookie. This is a in-action Lawrence Taylor rookie. Terry Bradshaw, second year. 
second year Montana in action. A couple more autographs here. Vintage football. Bob Greasy. Baseball. Vintage baseball. Here's a Willie Mays and Richie Ashburn 59 tops. Jordan. Bose. 57 tops. Duke Schneider. Strawberry rookie. 61 Ron San or 62 rather Ron Sano and some more vintage baseball here 53 68 and 56 and finally the best card out of the group like I said 500 on everything you know the Kobe jerseys and we got a Pat Mahomes this is his rookie card or his rookie year we got a jersey mahomes kareem hunt and tyreek hill this is number 22 out of 49. i don't have a ton of this kind of stuff but you know pat mahomes rookie jersey i think this is about a 250 fifty dollar card maybe three but i paid less than 100 bucks like I said, 500 for everything here. Really a, a small show, but you just never know what you're going to find at any show, really. You might have somebody that's just trying to clear out as much stuff as possible. And the more you buy, the better you can, the better deal you can get. And honestly, I tried to make a deal for everything he had. He didn't really want to sell everything at once, but he had probably 50,000 cards there. So... One of these days, he probably had more than that, but one of these days I'm going to hit a big score like that, hopefully pick up a huge collection, and I'll have a lot of, of content to be showing you if I do that. Hopefully that will happen soon. Like I said, I'm, I'm not trying to hang on to any cash. Like If I go to a show and sell whatever I sell, hopefully sell stuff, and it's going right back into buying. Hopefully at that show, if not the next one or online or whatever, I'm buying as much as I possibly can. And, you know, but at the same time, I'm looking for the best deal possible. I'm not going to just buy whatever. I'm trying to buy the best stuff at the best price. So as you can see, there's a wide range of cards that were between 50 cents and 100 bucks. So. I'm not looking for just high dollar cards or just a couple cards. I'm looking for bulk and quality, whether it's higher price or even lower price. So that's it for this one, guys. I'm going to have I have more stuff coming in. These, these videos are once a week, so please stay tuned for those. If you guys know anybody that are into cards, I think they might appreciate these videos. Um, that I'm making and some of the stuff that I'm picking up. So check out the links below. I got my eBay, ComC, and Instagram. Stay tuned for more and thanks for watching.